What's up, you bad motherfuckers? I'm usually showing you uh, pictures of Reefa and me getting high and me fucking around. I'm gonna introduce you to a cat that's got more heart than anybody you fucking ever met in your life, all right? This guy is not the best looking dude in the world. He kind of smells fucked up from time to time. When I first met him, he was a little fucking kitten. And he wouldn't mess with me at all, and I call him super bad. This guy's got more heart than fucking Alvarez and shit. All right, this guy is a fucking, look how he bites and shit. He don't give a fuck, but he licks you like a dog. Too bad. Look at him, he's a little motherfucker too. Look at him. He's always trying to bite me, this little fuck. Look at him, look at him, look at him. But this guy, let me tell you something. If I had a million dollars cash, or well, this guy, and there was a fire, I'd go for this guy first. Because you can't replace this little motherfucker. Look at him. He's just a little scumbag from day one. He'll lick you for a while, then, then he'll bite you. But he's just telling you that he loves you. This guy was dead. This is the guy I made a promise that if he would live, I'd never do coke again. That was nine years ago today. Look at him. Not nine years ago today, but that was eight years ago. It's going to be nine in November. When have you seen a cat lick somebody? Because he licks your hands. So now he bites you and he licks your hands. Nobody, this isn't the best looking cat in the world. He's not a fucking strange mix. You know, he's not no fucking whatever. But in the world of love and fucking, uh, you know, balls, I used to have this cat that was three times the size of this motherfucker. And super bad went after him one day and they fell in a fucking laundry basket and they almost fought to the fucking deck if I wouldn't have got him out of there. This guy's got the heart of a fucking silly little. Look at you, cocksucker. Cocksucker. I tell you what, you see this right here? I care more about this little guy than I have these fucking mutts I contact every day. This guy's got more heart than fucking balls. This is my shoe bag. Look, he's a fucking scumbag, but that's why I love him. Like I always say, I don't like nice fucking people. Nice people make me fucking nervous. It's savages like this. Look at him. <laughs> and he don't bite me hard. He's just dicking around me to let me know he loves me. Look at him. I don't leave the house. This guy licks my hand, I find a $20 bill. That's how solid this motherfucker is. Yesterday was National Dog Day. In my world, it's fucking cat day and dog day every fucking day, okay? That's how I look at things. If you got an animal, any fucking animal, I don't care if it's a fucking parrot, I don't care if it's a pet ant, you got to honor these motherfuckers every day. Because what they bring to your life, my friend, you'll never find anywhere else. There he goes. And that's it. That's the fucking minute report with my main man, super bad. It's not all about reef and strangling people and doing drugs and fucking around. Sometimes you gotta give animals love. So for all you national motherfucking animal days, suck my dick. In my house, it's national fucking cat and dog day and parrot day every fucking day, okay? Stay black. Uncle Joey loves you, cocksuckers.